Hey guys, Cece back with another video and this is going to be dun 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 another haul video. So I went to Sephora and I went to Nordstrom. I just got a couple of things, I promise. Just a few items. I had to make a return which in turn made me buy more stuff of course. But uh, yeah, we're going to keep this short and sweet. So if you guys want to see what I got in my haul, then definitely stay tuned. So the first thing I want to show you guys is from Sephora and they had like the best 500 point perk, perk ever. I never use my points because I never really see anything that I want but I have like 2,000 points so I was looking to see if they had anything good and lo and behold they had this Josie Marin Josie's Best and Brightest Argan Oil Essentials Kit. And I don't know if you've seen this, but if you have, run out and get it because it is amazing. It comes in this little box and it comes with four amazing products. You get a mini argan oil, like a Josie Marin argan oil. And if you guys saw my Play by Sephora box, then you know I had another mini come in that box. So, I'm set, girl. And then they also gave me the Pure Argan Milk Intensive Hydration Treatment. And this is supposed to, you're supposed to massage it three to five drops onto a clean face day and night. And you're supposed to finish up with the argan oil. So this is just supposed to be like a hydrating treatment for your face. Then I grabbed a mini, well not grabbed, this came in the box, a mini... What is this? Josie Marin Argan Infinity Lip and Cheek Cream Oil. And this one's in the color Everlasting Honey. And I guess it's just a mini cream, you know, cream stain that you can put on your lips and your cheeks. And the color is just absolutely beautiful. Then with that, this is what I was most excited about. I wanted to order this during the Sephora VIB sale, but they ran out before, um, they ran out of stock before I had a chance to order. But this is the Josie Marin Argan Enlightenment Illuminizing Veil, and it's just a really soft, subtle highlight. And I wanted this so bad, and I just could not get my hands on it. So I was so happy they had this in the kit. And then from Sephora, I picked up the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. If you guys have even watched one video on YouTube in the last, like, nine months, it's been all about the Urban Decay Naked Skin Concealer. I got mine in the color Medium Neutral, and I've heard so many amazing things about this concealer. It is just ridiculous. So... I swatched it once and I just noticed, just from that little swatch, how creamy it was and how easy it blends out. Like, oh, it blends out so easily. So, I, this color seems perfect to highlight underneath my eyes. I cannot wait to use it. I'm going to use it in a video and show you guys how it works and everything, but this little baby, I'm so excited about. Then with that, I picked up a Marc Jacobs foundation. Now, if you guys watched my last massive haul video with my Sephora VIB stuff, then you know that I bought the Marc Jacobs Remarkable foundation, but I got it in the wrong color. So I went back to find my correct color at Sephora, but when I got there, they didn't have a color that fit me. And she was like, oh, well, you can just buy both of these colors. And I'm like, uh, uh, heifa. For $55 a piece, they should have a color that fits me perfectly. I'm not buying two $55 foundations, okay? So, I quickly returned that one, and then I ended up getting the Marc Jacobs Genius Gel Foundation. Now, they did have my color in the Genius Gel, so I thought I would give that a try. And I've heard such great things about the Marc Jacobs Foundation, so... I'm just really excited that I can try one of them because I refuse to buy two $55 foundations. I'm just not going to do it. But this one's only $48, so it's not too bad. Only $48. But it's not too bad, but it's supposed to be really, really beautiful, and the color matches me perfectly. So I cannot wait to try this. Last thing I got at Sephora, and I told y'all it was a quick one. Um, this is the Laura Mercier Face Illuminator in Indiscretion. And I've been lusting after this for so long, but I was like, you know what? I'm not going to get it because I have enough highlighters, but girl, girl, I do not have enough highlighters if it looks like this, okay? This is absolutely beautiful. I've heard nothing but amazing things about this. Like, can we just take a moment of silence for that, please? Just look at it. Like, I can't stop staring 
I don't even want to use this. It's so pretty, but I definitely am because I think this was like $42. That's an expensive ass highlighter, but what can I say? Alright you guys, then I only got a couple more things. I bought a few things from Nordstrom and like this is boring. I got the MAC foundation pump to go with the foundation that I'm going to show you guys in a second. And then I grabbed, let me get this stuff off the bag. Alright, so then I grabbed this little Smashbox Tri Kit and this has the primer water as well as the photo finish foundation primer and it's just a little travel size kit. I needed something else to go with my purchase so it can equal to $50 so I can get a free sample bag. So that's why I got this. Um, I have the primer water. I don't love it. I like it. Don't love it. But um, I really like the foundation primer so I decided to go ahead and get the kit. And the size is... It won't come out. What the hell? Okay. <laughs> the sizes are really small, so you don't get very much, but it was $10, so I decided to go ahead and get those. And then the last thing I got is the Estee Lauder Double Wear. And you guys know I bought this from Sephora if you saw my last haul. But I got the wrong color, so I went to Nordstrom. My Sephora doesn't sell Estee Lauder in store. So I went to Nordstrom and they had it and so I had the lady match me and I finally got the correct color for this foundation and I got it in the color 4N2 Spice Sand and that's how that looks the color is absolutely beautiful on me it's perfect so I'm gonna be doing some videos with this baby and you guys know I already have this but I have it in the incorrect color so I'm so happy that I have it in the right color now Alright you guys, so those are all the items that I got. I told you guys it was a very small mini haul, but those are all the items that I picked up. If you have any questions, want to see any first impressions, or any type of videos with these products, definitely let me know down below. Don't forget to follow me on all of my social medias, as well as hit that subscribe button, girl, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Bye guys.